Hello again, lads. We're back here. Welcome back to the channel. And welcome to day 24 of Follow a Sketch of February, which is put on by the lovely Sandy, who is state goddess here on YouTube and the owner of Scrapping Reflections. This is our sketch today, and we have some big circles in the background and two photos. I'm going to do four because this big long piece right here and here I'm going to use as photos. And it is the Simple Stories Saturday Hop. So it's where my bestie Joanne Bartel has a group of peeps and we play with nothing but simple stories. Gonna do that. And then uh, my prompt for the day is a shaker pocket. So that's fun. So we can use, I know I've seen it. The Wine and Roses collection from the February Spiegel Mom Scraps release. And these are the four photos. I've got Sam opening up presents of Christmas in 2022. Yes, yeah, still trying to finish that all out. So let's just pull all of this out. Um. Maybe we can get that used up, so we'll focus on that. Focus on that. I have too many photos for that. Um, lots of washi. We can mat our photos. Some twine. Um, Pull this out. Look, already a circle. Okay. So, won't need that. These are all the scraps that I have left over. So. Could do a red background, more scraps to be found. Ooh, that'll be pretty for one of the circles. And the other side of it is a cut apart, so I so we'll use some of those. And let's pop in that black, All right? Do, do, do. Oh, everything's falling. We don't need the small circles today. And we're not going to use any of that, so I'm going to slide it back into the bag. I like to pare things down so that. Even though I still have a lot to choose from, it's not everything. It makes it harder for me if I have all of that to choose from. Okay. And we may want to bring that in. Probably not going to do anything with this. So we need one, two... Three. So we're going to go one, two, three with these. Actually, hmm. I think we'll do that strip out of this. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay. So, I've got the circle cutter, I'm going to do the big one in the green, I think we'll do, we'll do a 7 inch, and then we'll just kind of go down from there, right? So 
there's our seven inch. And then and then we'll go six. They just this only thing about this is it definitely uh oh. Careful, you can get it. <laughs> and I can still like fussy cut out because it's a uh, cut of parts is my um, prompt this month. Well, and then we went five. All cut. Did it really wasn't it's because I didn't have it locked all the way in, you guys. But it's all right. I can follow the path, and I'm gonna scuff the edges of them up so you won't really be able to tell if I didn't cut all that well. And then put that up. Okay, and then let's bring these back in. I want I want to fussy cut this guy out. And this one is kind of neat. And then you know what? We're just going to take that and I'll fussy cut out those flowers. Okay, what about this one? Fussy cut that. And then some more of these flowers. Why I can't talk when I'm fussy cutting, I don't know. I have ordered some new scissors because these things are about done. All right, and then this, I think I want that to be that strip that I said we weren't going to do, but I've changed my mind. So, let's just make it about there. And then go 12. All right. And then 12 on this one. Again, I don't know why I have to tear those in half. And oh my goodness, are you, have you guys been zoomed in this entire time? How bad has that been? Oh, not very bad. Okay. All right. So this is going to go like here. We're going to go this way. And then... We're going to scuff these up, but they're going to sit like like so. But let's move this over a little bit more this way. Bring this one over. And then we're going to have the photos in here. So I'm going to trim them down quite a bit. So I'm going to go ahead and trim these down. 
Um, how many do we have? Four? Yep. So we need... Um, we almost need red. Let's see if we can use that one and that one to get the four photos matted. All right, so I'm going to map the photos. I'm going to get this stuck down. I'm going to rough the edges up, and I'll be right back. So there's the sketch. Here's my interpretation. <laughs> We're done with that now. <laughs> Sketches are really, you can go right with them or you can just use them as a jump off. So I did fussy cut this out. I cut a screen here, the inside of that, fussy cut that, fussy cut that, cut the inside out here, fussy cut this and this. Then I made my three sugar pockets. And now when I have best ever up there. So let's just see what else we've got going on in the sticker book. So, we can come in with the Believe right here. Yeah, let's just tuck that in there. And then, we'll put this guy Right here, because I really like to put, I like to add things to the shaker pockets. So we got a couple more circles on there. Um, put a little joyful and holly jolly. And then we'll do the warm wishes right there. And then we've got we'll do Christmas time. We'll just pop him right here. I love these ones that look like washer. So we're going to layer this one up right over here on top of the other layers. Tradition in there. And some of the little floral deco. Just kind of beef that cluster up a little bit. And This one up here because why not? And come in with just a few little embellishments. And anything from this. Sticker sheet. I think I should pop around a few of the hearts. So we'll put this one there. We'll put this one up here. That one there. 
And then this one right up there. And you guys, I think that's going to do it for the layout. The only other thing that I would like to add is some uh, gold sketchy lines just to kind of complete it off and everything was roughed up. Shaker packet complete, simple stories complete, and follow a sketch complete, so that's a win. And that's going to do it for today's layout. So don't forget to check everyone else out that is playing along. Head on over to Spiegel Mom's Scripts and get you some wine and roses. Use my code to get a percentage off. It's always fun to get a little bit off. And check everybody else out that's playing along with the um, hops. Uh, follow a sketch and the simple stories. This was what I cut out of here, you guys. <laughs> so you can make a shaker pocket out of just about anything. And that's going to do it. Oh, I did want to try to get those on there. Do you think I can? I don't really want to force it on there, but quite possibly can slide that right there. And I don't know. I don't know if we're going to be able to get Santa Claus on there, so we're going to save him for next time. But next time will be one I can use up and then move on. All right, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me, and I will catch you later with another video. Bye.